Hi everyone, I have to show you something about Roblox that many parents don't know about. So here Dom Lucre, uh, breaker of narratives. I don't know what his political affiliation is. I don't know anything about him. Honestly, uh, that is not even the point. The point is Roblox has a lifestyle game where children can go in and recreate sexual acts with bots or other characters. Adults are taking advantage of this to commit these acts on children. So Roblox is a very, very popular game. Some of the students that I have who are as young as seven play this um, probably about uh, one or two hours a day at the minimum. So it's a very, very popular video game. And uh, there is a section which I'm going to elaborate in just a second. But uh, if you see this is the kind of role playing that children can be engaged in and they don't even know that they are being violated in the virtual world so i'm glad that this is being brought up because parents have to know and there is no need to panic there are a lot of parental controls and one more disclaimer i am not a roblox spokesperson if it is inevitable that our children are going to end up playing video games, it is upon us as parents to understand how we can navigate the digital world without any physical or psychological harm to our children. So that is why I am speaking out here. If you see, so that is why I don't let my kids get on Roblox at all. I know the schemes they're up to. One of the benefits of being young enough to have grown with the internet so he this gentleman seems to be a young parent who grew up with the internet but i didn't know it was this bad out here for parents bro for real so yeah a lot of things are happening we have been talking about it uh, here at future strong academy the kind of things that kids are using at 10 pm what are the different apps they're using what are they indulging in so we have talked about it in length here so I'm going to post a link to this here, searching for condos. So what this is in Roblox is there is a specific feature. There are some games commonly referred as condos and they are Roblox multiplayer sex games. These games are generated by users. Of course, a lot of them are generated by users. And that is the beauty of Roblox because you can create something out of nothing. So Minecraft, um, and Roblox and all these games can be thought of as creative games. And of course, with time limit, with parental supervision, with uh, children understanding the right context of what they are doing and why they are doing it, it's very important. And, you know, this is the digital era and they will have to somehow at some point engage with their devices, whether we like it or not. So where people talk about sex and where their avatars can engage in virtual sex as expected here is where roblox rules cease to apply okay all you have to do is search for condo in the search bar on the site and games that display explicit scenes naked avatars and crude language in the chat transcripts can manifest imagine a seven-year-old nine-year-old 11-year-old 13-year-old who does not have any context Okay, and who does not know what is the norm as far as a safe space or a bad touch is concerned, you know, imagine the impact, long lasting impact that this can have. Of course, there is no need to panic. There are many places where you can find parental controls on Roblox. And that is why I request to parents to please, please, please try to as much as possible engage with your child and ask what they're up to on their devices. So here I will play a video uh, to quickly make you understand what is happening in the field of um, video games and how this gentleman ended up finding out about Roblox and all these adult content here. Um, thank you so much. So this gentleman posts a reply to this post and uh, will will save the kids Oday Pro Hacker, dedicated to ch protecting children from online exploitation, posted this warning about the game Roblox. Let's check it out. I'm extremely disgusted at what I just found in the Roblox community. I started off in a role play server that was accessible from the main Roblox application. Didn't say anything about an age restriction. After joining that role play server, I received a direct message that told me to join this chat application. 
They say they do not allow anyone under the age of 18 to be in the server. The main Roblox application doesn't allow you to speak this way, but when you join these private communities, you can see horrible things like this. Here's another very strange server that's accessible directly from the Roblox homepage. If you were unaware like I was about these sub-communities that exist within a children's application or Roblox condos, um, I would look further into it, ask your children if they know what it is, and they need to know that it's okay, in my opinion, to tell you that uh, stuff like this is happening. Thank you so much. Knowledge is power. Let us equip ourselves with knowledge so that we are not scared about what our children are up to and what they are facing every single day in the online space of strangers. Thank you.